So when I got to Montreal, I was really excited to find that there's actually a bit of a cafe culture here, like um, you can just sit around and read your book while you drink your tea for two hours. Um, and I thought that having a cafe culture would mean that they had a coffee culture, because the French word for coffee is cafe. But I was wrong. Um, <laughs> people still really don't know a lot about coffee, which, you know, I'm not saying they have to. I was just a bit surprised. Um, of course, my job being making people coffee, it astounds me the number of people, and I mean like everyone, who they ask for a coffee and I'm like, yeah, okay, so what would you like? They're like, I don't know. I'm like, really? Do you really not know what you'd like? I'm like, would you like milk? Would you like it strong, weak, black, white, you know, decaf? <laughs> and they're just like, oh, um, yeah, I'll have it black. And then once I give it to them, they're like, oh, can I have milk? And it's like, oh. But this isn't even about people knowing what they drink and whether they like coffee. This is about simple communication. It's like stunning to me that so many people don't speak communication as a first language. But there you go.